Hi beautiful family and welcome to another of my videos. Well it's been a while since I filmed. We are here on the regular schedule now three times a week so if you want to see me reviewing the Kaya Cosmetics uh, new bronzers and highlighters that is what we are going to do today then please keep on watching. Okay guys I didn't want to make this video too long but I have two, uh, two of the lightest shades of Kaya Cosmetics bronzers. I have uh, the shade Gold Coast and um, La Digu, the guy, the guy, you can't pronounce, I will put the names on the screen. And I also have two lighter shades of highlighters that is Sydney and also Saint Tropez. These are outside the packaging a little bit dirty because I've been using uh, two of the shades for a couple of weeks since it launched actually I just didn't have time or energy to film but this is how the product looks inside it has a nice mirror and this is the highlighter um, this shade is the second lightest shade let me swatch it here now if you can see it's beautiful pigmentation and the lighter shade is this one Sun Tropez that's the lightest shade the second shade is the one that I just swatched so this is the shade that's the lightest and of course they are buildable I have this plastic on this has more like a champ uh, champagne golden light shade this is more like pink now you can see beautiful it kind of reminds me of the Ofra highlighters I'm going to put the link and the price down below then I have the two bronzers this one is the second lightest shade is the one that i've been using and if you can see uh there it, it, it's not shimmery but it has that i won't call it shimmery it has a glow so it's not a matte highlight uh, bronzer i don't have anything i have i have no contour no bronzer on my face today just base this is the shade gold coast it's the second the uh, lightest shade and they are buildable very easy to build up and then I have the lightest shade here La I think the names are cute even if I can't pronounce them uh, it kind of reminds me of uh, the packaging reminds me of hourglass packaging it has same sheen and almost I think same shade same shade of the packaging this is the lightest uh, one and actually you can use all of these maybe not the lightest on a darker skin tone but they are made so you, um, doesn't matter which one you buy it depends on undertone and depends what you're looking for but doesn't matter which one you, you buy you can build it up um, it's easy to build up let me swatch it here that's the lightest shade so I'm going to use a widest on this part of the face and a darker one, or so the step darker on this part of the face, just to show you how it looks. But let's go to the lightest shade of the bronzer and try it on the face. Um, I'm going to use my favorite brushes. This is from uh, Morphe and um, Jeffree Star. They're very buttery. They're powder but a very powdery and let's apply it very smooth it doesn't skip it blends into the skin very easy to build up I'll be using the darker shade um, second darker shade for weeks now and I've been loving it if you can see this is one coat now I can definitely build it up which is what I'm going to do just to show you easy to build up you can't go wrong you can't what I like about this it's that you don't you you don't take too much of the product immediately and uh, then it you have hard time to blend this is very easy to build build up you can see this lighter shade here I really like this um, it's very natural so if you want very natural shade then you have similar shade or skin tone as I have then this one is maybe for you this is how it looks and if you can see it a little bit on the nose 
and now immediately this part of the face is more alive. Let's go to the second shade and go with another brush. So you can. I really like this. They are not. There is no fallout of these bronzers and. I love Kai Cosmetics products. So you can see this one is more warm. I uh, like this shade more on my skin tone. Uh, but this is more, I don't know. I kind of like this. I'm, into, <laughs> I'm kind of considering to buy all four shades, uh, just to experiment, but you can see now the difference between them. Now I'm going to use the highlighters. Let's go to the lighter, hi lighter highlighter. I don't want to make this video too long. This is just me um, trying. This is Morphe and Jaclyn Hill highlighter brush. Very nice. Just a little bit of, you can see, oh, that's the glow. Can you see the glow? That's the glow. Real like, doesn't look ashy on the side. Sometimes these kind of shades make my uh, look ashy on me, but this one definitely doesn't. I really like this highlighter. Really like it. Let's go to the second shade that I've been using a lot. Uh, and this is the Sydney. I'm going to use another brush, of course. This is uh, Sosu and Kayla. And you can see that it's been used. <laughs> the champagne shade. Can you see that? They look wet and very nice. And these stay on the face for uh, the whole day until you take off your makeup. So I use this on this part of the face and these on this part of the face. And I love it. I love it. Uh, this is the lighter shade. Let's go through it again. If you missed, the bronzer is La Dague. Da da and this is the highlighter. I'm going to put the names here on the screen instead of me talking and saying. Um, and then we have the second, the lightest shades here. I don't know, which one do you prefer, guys? I think I prefer this because I like more of that uh, bronzy look, but I love all of the Kaya Cosmetics products. I have their lipstick on with a little bit of a lip gloss on top. I just like, like Kaya Cosmetics. They are cruelty-free, they are um, not, cheapest but also not very expensive the prices are somewhere in between and i kind of like the price because you get uh for that price you get a nice packaging and beautiful products i also have the face brushes i don't uh eyes brushes i don't have the face brushes i need to get those but that was everything guys this is how it looks on my skin tone i really like her cosmetics uh, check them out. I will leave, leave link and information down below. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't. And I see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye guys.